everyone, this is Kara Lefrak with KSL Collective and Keller Williams on the Water in Sarasota. I'm here with Brian from SWF uh, Inspections. Hi, thanks for being here with me today. We're actually in the middle of inspecting a, a home for a client right now. And we're just gonna talk, about, uh, we're gonna give our, uh, our viewers a tip about roofs. Yes. So go for it. So when it comes to a roof and you have vegetation on the exterior of your house, within close proximity to the rooftop. It's always a good idea to keep it uh, trimmed back. Uh, that includes vines, trees, palm trees, as you can see behind me. Uh, this particular palm has been rubbing on the roof and has actually reduced the granules on that particular slope. So uh, with uh, deterred main maintenance on that, you can actually end up with uh, an expense you weren't expecting. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and the insurance companies are gonna look for that, right? Like I know my, my insurance a, uh, agents sometimes will actually, they'll send people and they'll take pictures every year. Yes. And then they'll say, hey, time to trim those trees, right? Yes. And that's yes. gonna insurance save you lots of dollars. Insurance companies will get involved in all of this kind of stuff because it does cost them uh, when you make a claim for something that uh, potentially should have been taken care of. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so the tip of the day is make sure you're trimming your trees, right? It's a much less yes. expense, you know, to do it once a year or so uh, instead of having to replace your whole roof and spending tens of thousands of dollars. Correct. Right? Okay. It also keeps the uh, outside vermin from having an avenue to climb, climb on your roof. Good point. Good point, Brian. Well, thank you so much. It's thank been you. a pleasure. Thank See you, you guys later.